All right, brothers and sisters, it is Saturday the Sabbath, September 30th, and uh, we are on our way to Detroit, Michigan, and Christy is my helper today. Say hello, Christy. Hi, everyone. Christy says hello, and uh, I'm going to take you along with us today as we go out and we try to reach the homeless in Detroit, Michigan. All right, we're in uh, Detroit, Michigan on 8 Mile, on a famous 8 Mile that uh, I'm sure a lot of you have heard about. Eight Mile in Detroit, we're out with our homeless outreach ministry. And this is, uh, I'm not driving, so don't worry. Christy's driving, and I'm filming. And usually, a lot of homeless on Eight Mile in Detroit. And, uh, we're just passing Telegraph on Eight Mile, so I just thought I'd uh, take you along for the ride to share this day with us. Let's get an idea of what it's like to go out with the homeless ministry. Quite a few homeless on 8 Mile Road. It's about a little bit after 11 o'clock in the morning. So uh, we're just going to see uh, who we can help today. And this is 8 Mile in Detroit. I don't know we turned around because we've seen a couple of people up here. I don't know where they went. But, uh, but we're going to turn around and stay with us today. Alright, we are uh, on 8 Mile in Detroit, right at the city limits. And under this viaduct, let me back out a little bit. There's usually a lot of homeless uh, that we uh, tend to, so we're going to see if anyone's under the viaduct here. And just uh, So you kind of get a, an idea of what it's uh, all about. What this ministry is all about, trying to help those that uh, are in need or hungry. And, not really asking for a handout, they just want someone to help them up and get them back up on their feet. And, uh, just gotta give you an idea here. No crates. And a lot of times this is where they sleep at night, right under a bridge like that, or over past. Sleeping under the bridge. Detroit, Michigan. We got some of the building. Let me back it uh, off a little bit. There we go. We're out here, this is Detroit, right? Eight Detroit. Mile. Mm -hmm. And uh, did you want to give your first name? I'm Joshua. Joshua? And Tanya. And Tanya. Uh, you kind of want to tell your story. Right now you're on hard times. And uh, what do you think the church needs to do? The people are out here. Help more. Help the homeless. Do, do they help you at all? No. More food no. and more, more aid. More shelter. More shelter and more, you know, more stability for us. So know, how, do, how do people treat you out here? Do they treat you good? Horrible. or Horrible. Horrible? So um, we're out here everyone and uh, I want you to reach into your heart and uh, let's join together and see what we can do to, to fight this uh, terrible uh, affliction of homelessness, especially in Detroit and Flint, Michigan. Thank you guys. We're able to help you today a little bit. Yes, yes. thank you so much. All right. God bless you. God bless you. And here we are pulling in an eight mile at the Myers. You can see the homeless gentleman sitting there with a the shopping cart. And we're going to go minister to him and we're going to get him some food and uh, try to make a difference and touch his life today in a positive way. Stay with us. All right, brothers and sisters, uh, Pastor Dave, it's Saturday, Sabbath, and we're out here on 8 Mile with this fine gentleman. And I'm not going to put you on the spot, but I'm not sure to give your name. 
what do you think we can do? There's so much homelessness out in the city of Detroit. And, uh, what do you think the church should do? What do you think the church should do? I don't know. think they can help people more. Help people more. A lot of people don't help you. What I want to ask, I got, I got my viewers. I, he needs help. He needs to get away from homelessness. He needs to get shelter and, and, and housing. I need someone to pull together for him. And you know who you are. That God is going to touch your heart. And we need some help. You got a little doggy there too. You got a little dog, and he's hungry too. We need to pull together as a church. And I want someone to adopt this young man here. Someone adopt him, and let's get him out of the situation that he's in. Alright, God bless you, God bless you, brother. Okay.